Ooh, new new music, dude. Unlimited gasoline. Now we're talking. What, a, dude? This is like uh, all a sun shower. This is like N64, like like Diddy Kong racing music. When I first joined the force, this lumber room was still in full swing. It closed up right when I first moved here. And now it's totally abandoned. I presume so. I've never really been inside, so I don't know for sure, but it sure is run down. Deserted buildings are perfect for criminal hideouts and activities. I keep telling Harry to have the place torn down. Probably. After all, it's already well, we're going. We don't need roads. We don't know that for sure yet, Agent Morgan. That's right. But the perpetrator selected the lumber. Agent York, you seem very confident about this. Confident? <laughs> Confidence is a sweet spot between rude and hopeless. I'm just drawing natural conclusions from the facts that we've seen. That sounds exactly like being full of confidence, at least to me. And to normal people with common sense. Common sense can be the opposite of facts and times. Oh, I will, Agent York. Thank you for another pearl of wisdom. Either way, we'll know for sure by simply going to the lumber mill. So keep your pearl oh, no. to yourself, and let's hurry. Well said, George. Can you step on it, Agent York? Dude, the Dazio was great practice for this. I'm getting loaded here. We're financially comfortable. Sequence break. Look it up, sweetheart. Now check your map. I don't need a stinking map. Look, it's right there. What is this song? It's like algorithmically created beats. Chill beats that under no circumstances should you ever study to. Punch it. Yeah, Josh, what's on the docket tomorrow? You want to play some kind of game of social deduction, I heard. My subreddit ratted you out. I didn't see what was second there. Is there a fried egg on the ground? Let's go and find out if your facts can be trusted. You're full of confidence, right? Let's get to the lumber mill. It's like you boot up your Game Boy, it starts playing this song, you know you just wasted 60 bucks. It's like that Batman game for the Game Boy, where, like, in order to get past the first level, like, you fight your way through one big hallway, and it's super easy. 
And then at the end, you just get to a door, and you're like, what, do I, what the hell do I do with this door? I haven't learned anything that lets me do anything with this door. You just jump up and down 75 times, try to figure out what the hell you're supposed to be doing. All of a sudden, you know, you, 10 days later, you're talking to your friend. He goes, oh, you gotta use, uh, you gotta use your wall climb ability. They didn't teach me the wall climb ability. How am I supposed to know that I have it? Oh, don't even get me started on James Bond 007 for the Game Boy. Start the game, no idea what the hell I'm supposed to do. Walk around town for 25 years. Go get the Brady Game Strategy Guide six months later. It goes, hey, there's a hammer in a hidden wall at the start of the game. You use that to fix the bridge so that you can get to the, the town and the real game starts then. Forehead, exactly. Need you stay here. I can't concentrate on profiling with other people around me. Now hold on a minute. We're investigating this case together. Listen, I can't risk the crime scene being compromised by you two. What are you saying? You're not the only professional law enforcement officer here, Agent Morgan. You know how to secure a crime scene. I'm sorry. Stop flashing your that guns at me. Rude of me. But this is how I operate. Furthermore... Yes? Furthermore what? To me, the outsider FBI agent, every citizen of this town is a suspect. You two could be in on this whole thing for all I know. I have to keep suspects out of the crime scene. Yeah, but you could be the killer as well. Is he making fun of us? <laughs> we should have left him behind and come here by ourselves. You're right. I've never been so insulted. Sorry, but I'm just doing my job. Is he making fun of us? That didn't feel right. Yo, it's got a high attack. Did you hear that, Zach? If they're pros, then we should let every first-person shooter gamer out there join the SWAT team. Got him? Zach, they're here. Every first-person shooter gamer out there. Oh. Yeah, exactly. He wasn't talking about me because I play Therpy. Great. Hey! It's the first time I've been hit all stream. Yes. Sit yourself. Amazing. <laughs> I don't need any more steel pipes. I'm okay. Let me reload, please. He's so good. I don't know why I haven't quoted Freddy Got Fingered here, because they really are the backwards man, the backwards man. I can walk backwards as fast as you can. Got him. 
Can anyone explain what's happening with the zombies? Oh no, absolutely not. I have no idea. <laughs> it will kind of get explained later. Just as I okay. thought, Zack. This is where Anna was killed. Fix your spine. Yo, thanks for the posture. Posture check. Oh. Much better. Hey. Come here. No. Drink some water too. I will when the stream's over. I'm already creatined up. You got nothing to worry about. Bernie Sanders is streaming. When his stream ends, or when your stream ends, are you gonna raid him? Um, I'm a bigger streamer than Bernie, so if he raids me, then maybe I'll raid him the next time. But I'm not gonna raid him first. It's not the way this works. Too much noise. We're still missing a vital piece of the puzzle. Oh, 20 bucks is 20 bucks. Yo, it's a new gun. Oh, it's it's just a mannequin. Zack, it's almost like an altar. Was the murder some kind of ritual? You got a couple of love seats too. <laughs> it's, the, it's like the most cursed telephone I've ever seen. That reminds me, actually, uh, I cleaned my keyboard for, like, the first time in, I don't know, probably, like, a year this weekend. Gross. Nice, now that it's clean. It feels good to get all the gunk out of there, but, uh, well, most of the gunk out of there. Where are you hiding? But while cleaning it, I was like... Supposedly, that's the uh, that's the sound it makes when the sound effect doesn't load properly. The that one. No, I don't need to change my suit, honestly. I think I'm okay. Yo, so many keys, dude. Thomas is gonna be stoked. It's a normal sound effect. It's just not supposed to fire that often. Yo, smoked salmon? We are in the PN dog. To save my game, please. Wow, amazing.
Don't don't shoot. Don't swing. Amazing. Let me buy it, please. <laughs> it does sound like they're saying they love my CD. What a camera angle. Yes. Send them. Oh, the engine room, which I thought was the engineering room. It all over. Won't budge without a good whacking. <laughs> what a horrible sound. I am stunned that that worked, by the way. But it did. Yo, madam! I just saved your life. Show some respect. Yes. Move! Get out the way! You're not dead! I shot you in the head. Don't make me eat my smoked salmon. through my bullets. I'll shoot you in the ponytail. I do love how he compliments himself. It's like mouth in PUBG. Amazing. That's a headshot, nice excuse me. Yo, this is Dexter's origin story. Yeah, not De Dexter Morgan, exactly. Dexter Anderson. Yo, they're gonna startle me, dude. Not in the toilet, David! Someone's been eating Arby's. We need that steel pipe, dude.
great amazing bullseye great amazing bullseye I know I've said it many times before it's a legit slapper that's not an ironic slapper Let me through, please. Let me through, please. Thank you. Of course I'm making bank. I'm the greatest agent in the FBI. Headshot. Great. I land non-stop headshots. Just me and my boy Zach hanging out. NL, do you still remember the bully music? Uh, does the Pope shit in the woods? Of course I remember it. It's seared into my brain. Right next to, like, you know, my first memories of this world. Great. Bullseye. No! Yes. Disarmed. Yes. Get out of here. Keep dry. I don't know why, but in my head, I'm like, dude, we're the baby. I know it doesn't make any sense. I just can't shake the feeling that we're going to walk through here and uh, be the baby. Gearbox. Borderlands 3 on Tuesday. Don't forget. Not hashtag ad. Great. Bullseye. 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 Yes. Great. Stop wavering. I'm saving the Uzi for the boss. Bullseye. Plus, I don't even have a stock yet. Yes. Nice shot. You know, when I use it, they call it a snoozy. Because it puts the enemies to sleep. Puts him to sleep permanently. Do not go in there. Amazing. I don't care if there's goods in there. I want. Bring me Holyfield. I want to take on the boss. This is a boss arena right here. Stop rushing. Headshot reward. A shot. Great. Amazing. Do not go in there is from Austin Powers. Uh, excuse me, do not go in there is from Ace Venture, a pet detective. After 
Austin Powers disposes of uh, the Irish assassin. Tom Arnold turns to him and says, What did you eat? It's a completely a different joke. Bullseye, yes. Nice shot. They're always after me, Lucky Charms. Exactly. It's freaking exactly, dude. There's some machinery behind the elevator. It has power, all right, but the motor doesn't seem to be working. I'll be the judge of that. Yes, the joke is that Tom Arnold thinks that Austin Powers ate and then shit out uh, an entire human man. And I quote, That's right. You show that turd who's boss. End quote. Good afternoon, buddy. We got a new shipment of wet food. He's he's fully satiated. Austin Powers one is great, two is okay, three is god awful. Absolutely, one hundred percent the correct uh -huh. power rankings. Um. Just yanked out a clown's pubic hair. <laughs> it's Ronald McDonald cleaning his shower. Yo, new song. Great. Bullseye. Not a new song, by the way. Stop, bro. Shoot. Stay frosty. Yeah, bring back the Shugo Tokomaru. Get in the corner? This is why I love therapy. You can peek all angles. Okay, that's a good time for a save. I got another um, 10 minutes or so, Kate, because I started late. I was eating tacos carnitas. Let's try to make a little bit more progress. You aren't allowed to say it with an accent. Watch me. Tacos. Carnitas. Gross. Great. 
Yes. Great. Yes. Get him. A lot of hallways in this game, huh? It's a hallway rich game. Hey, look, it's a palm tree. Good one. Ha! <laughs> Magnificent. No, I don't want any more steel pipes. A lot of people in this game have some serious back problems. Greenvale is in desperate need of a licensed chiropractor. Let me get through the combat and get back to the dialogue, please. Oh, where the heck did you come from? I want to get back to the music. We had a very rich music episode this week. Could always use a little bit more. I know people say chiropractic, chiropractors, I should say, is like a pseudoscience. But don't they also, I mean, I don't disagree because I, I got in trouble for saying this once and I looked it up. But like, don't they also go to like the equivalent of med school? Why do they have to go to school for like eight years to get a degree in a fake science? It's chiropractic school. How long do you have to go to chiropractic school? To become a licensed chiropract chiropractor. Two days? That's bullshit. I don't buy it. One to two weeks? I don't buy it. You can't even get like a scrum master certificate in one to two weeks. Dentist 2? No, it's not true. Not Dentist 2. Dentists are very well qualified, in principle at least. However, we have a friend who is a dentist. He has become a little bit disillusioned. I will I thought being a dentist was just about like, you know, doing root canals and stuff like that. And he was like, nah, you're almost like a salesman at some point because, you know, routine dental checkups, you make like almost no money, but like actual dental work is where you make the bulk of your salary. I was mad though. I was like, oh shit, Robert was right. He's good. <laughs> Almost as difficult as the chest puzzle. You got doorknob. 
dentists don't get a medical degree. No, I know dentists don't go to med school, but like, I mean, they're not literal doctors, but they are medical professionals. You don't, you don't become a dentist taking, you know, online courses. A shot. Yeah, Kate's, uh, Kate's sister is a dentist. She has like a, a bachelor's in biochemistry. And then like whatever the first Great. dental yes. degree is. I don't remember the distinction. Bullseye. From like UCLA. I think she's probably, she's okay. USC, sorry, not UCLA. DDS, that's right. A shot. Yes. Just back it. We got enough for everybody. Just back it up. Bullseye. I still think, like, being a dentist. Even though our friend tells us it's not that good, I still think it would be a pretty sick job. I'm not saying it's the easiest job in the world. Like, let's be honest. I already have that. But, like, secondarily... Being a dentist for, like, 90% of checkups, I'm pretty sure you literally just... Like, the dental hygienist does 98% of the work, and then you go in and you go, eh, floss. And then you're like, that'll be three hundred dollars, please. Huh? But then every once in a while, you gotta pull. You gotta pull like seventy teeth out of a man's head. He's got an addiction to sugary sodas. Peeled off fake fingernail. That's, that's fine. Wait, there's a phone back there. What happened to my phone, dude? That's oh, it's back here, isn't it? Alright. It's perfect timing. Dude, it, it flew by. I had a great time playing Deadly Premonition today. Started to drag a little bit um, once we're in the lumber mill, but I'm sure we got to be pretty close to the end of the lumber mill section here. I'm excited to see uh, what happens next week. For now, let me um, I'll put my intermission screen up real quickly. Give you a little peek at the Tomo. Hello, Tomo. He's a little irritated, I think. I would be too. I mean, he was just taking a snooze. Oh, he's not irritated at all. He's like, yeah, 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 ped me more. Yeah, 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 ped me more. What about now, Tomo? You want to show him some more of your face? Tomo. It's okay. I'll put the box back. You can get back in. Dama. He's back in the box. Anyway. I got cat fur everywhere, buddy.